Hello, my name is Mohanov Zain and I am the student of 9th grade. So my topic is uh, censorship, as you can see. And so, censorship. What do you think about this word? And what are your associations? Totalitarian governments, dystopic images, and guys with mustaches? That might be your the most direct association with this topic. And you all will be right, to some extent. This is because censorship, though connected in our minds with this relatively distant about that things, is still affecting our life and our minds right here and right now. According to Online Oxford Dictionary, Censorship is a suppression or prohibition of any parts of media that are considered threatening or simply bad. So, have you, uh, this sounds kind of obvious, you know? But, however, what if I will tell you that it did way more to shape our mindset? Now, it's the time for a short story. My friend's mom, who grew up in USSR, looked through an Instagram feed and she found one controversial post. I don't remember the content exactly, but it was connected to government and it's not a matter. So there is an interesting part. People in comments used, let's say, bad lexicon. You know what I'm talking about, right? <laughs> So, uh, to describe what happened next, I can use only three words. She was horrified. She started complaining, like, who gave them a pass to comment section and how dare they use such words when they are talking about government. Actually, uh, my friend was shocked too. Uh, she, uh, he was shocked and surprised to see his mom scream at him just because someone wrote bad things about government. People in USSR never said that, that kind of things about government, but we, the people who live now, may not follow the censorship rules. So it's normal for us to, how to say, use bad words in our daily routine. So, yeah. <laughs> um, have you ever heard about hate speech laws? So, uh, there is, a, what if I will tell you that we are, there are the breaking point. So, people who live in the USSR are scared of censorship, and we are not scared of censorship, yeah? So, there is a growing tide of government control all over the world that, together with radical movements uh, and usage of terrorism for rights violation. New Generation Z, like us, is grown up in that situation of constant threat of bomb at school or mad fanatic shooter at mall. Our parents and grandparents who were suppressed by censorship are they don't know about protection that we demand. Though not all of course. So our generation voted for hate speech laws that are def that are matching the definition of Censorship. Hate speech laws are indeed the prohibition of any parts of media that are considered threatening. In this case, offense to specific groups of people like Jews or LGBTQ community. So that invokes a question. Will our generation 
be remembered as sellers of liberty. What we value more, security or freedom? And is there a way to combine both? These decisions might seem frightening, but you have to know that there is always a spoon of honey in a tar barrel. This all is up to us. Thank you.